Hey everybody, thanks for dropping by the Star Wars headquarters. Hope you're all doing good. Let me know what you've been up to in the comments. And as you know, yesterday, both the Ark Trooper, who is a dual-wielding beast, and the Droid Commando, who wields a Vibro Sword, were revealed yesterday. We already went over all of the abilities and details on these two awesome reinforcements that will be releasing alongside the new game mode on March 26th. And if you missed that, uh, I'll leave a link in the description down below so you can check it out. But today, we are talking about all new details on the two new reinforcements, including info on how much health they will have, which modes they will be available to play in, uh, battle point costs, uh, will they cost any credits to unlock, and so much more, including when you can expect the next community transmission for the large scale game mode and lightsaber combat changes so tons of stuff to go over in this video hit that like button if you are looking forward to playing with the droid commando and the arc trooper on march 26th like i am but let's dive into all of the stuff we're going to go over in this video starting off with a question from Luke on Twitter. So Luke asked, is this a reinforcement type that's unique to the new game mode or will they be available in every expected mode? And the community manager Jay responded and said, every expected mode. So you can expect to play with the new ARC Trooper and the new Droid Commando in all of the modes that you'd expect a reinforcement to appear in, including uh, the new game mode, Galactic Assault, Blast mode, and Arcade mode, and I believe even Strike mode as well, if I'm not mistaken. So those should be the modes. If I missed out on one, let me know in the comments below, but uh, those should be the modes you can expect to play in with the new reinforcements. Now, also, uh, Darth... Baldi asked, will the reinforcements cost credits? And that's a really good question. And uh, Jay responded with, nope. So you don't have to worry about, you know, paying credits for the reinforcements. They're going to be simply unlocked. They're not going to be like heroes where you have to pay like 35,000 or 40,000 credits to unlock the reinforcements, which is really good news. So that's a relief. Now, uh, concerning actual battle point costs, uh, Christian Johansson uh, respond about this and said it's still being tweaked so no, no final number yet won't be drastically different from our existing reinforcements though so i'm guessing you know with the droid commando uh and the arc trooper they're probably going to be similar to the cost of you know like a jump trooper or a death trooper for instance so should be very similar to what you have to uh what, what you have to spend in battle points with those reinforcements. So it shouldn't be too much of a difference there. Now, uh, with dual wielding pistols, so as you notice, you know, the, um, uh, you know, ARC Trooper dual wields two pistols, and uh, everyone has been talking about this, like, will we get any more units that will dual wield pistols? You know, will we eventually see heroes like Captain Rex, or uh, perhaps, you know, we'll see Cad Bane, or even Jango Fett, and, uh, you know... This is the question that Dean had for the community manager. He said, are there any plans to either make dual wielding weapons available to trooper classes, most likely officer, say allow you to dual wield the default weapons of that class at either a certain level upon X amount of kills? And are there plans to do more with dual wielding? And Jay responded and said, for now, dual wielding, will be exclusive to the ARC Troopers. Now, notice he said, for now. So, could we be getting more dual-wielding units or heroes in the future? I really hope so. Like, I really want to see uh, Captain Rex as a hero and also Cad Bane as a hero. Imagine them on the battlefront battling each other. That'd be so cool to see. But let me know what other dual wielding heroes or units would you like to see in star wars battlefront 2 let me know now just to be clear i want to see ahsoka and ventress first as the next two heroes but after those two i would love to see captain rex and cad bane come to star wars battlefront 2 how cool would that be now 
concerning uh, their health. So concerning their health, uh, BLT asked how much HP will each reinforcement have? Also, how many battle points will they cost? We already answered the battle points question, but uh, Jay responded said 350 HP pending final balancing. And then, then he said BP is still being defined. Now remember, battle points should be around the same cost as other reinforcements. But there you go. At least we know what they're aiming for concerning the new reinforcements health. Now also, if you're wondering if we're going to get any more you know, images or pictures of these reinforcements, uh, Jamie asked, can we get normal pictures of both of the reinforcements? And Jay responded and said, you're going to get super nice ones, I believe. It should be in a blog next week or so. So we're expecting more clear images you know, than what we have so far. But at least we got these awesome GIF animations here. I mean, we got to see them in motion, so I'm not complaining. This is freaking awesome right here. I mean, look at this droid commando. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to play with him. Also, look at this art trooper charging forward. He just looks freaking awesome. So again, at least we got these uh, animations right here. And personally, I think they're almost better than images because you get to see them in motion. So that was a really cool reveal to see them in motion like that. Now, also, let's move on to when we can expect the next community transmission. So, Clance asked, what will be the next community transmission, the new game mode, or lightsaber changes? And Jay confirmed that the next community transmission will be about the new game mode. And then he went on to say it will be aiming for next week. So, we can expect all the details on the new game mode including what this new game mode will be called so next week is going to be a huge week probably the week that i've been waiting for for my entire life that might be an over exaggeration but i've been waiting for a while just like all of you so i cannot wait to find out all of the details on this new game mode next week now what about lightsaber combat well jan asked and what about lightsaber combat changes community transmission are we still going to get it and uh, Jay confirmed that, yes, it'll be the third community transmission that we get. So that will be after the game mode community transmission. Now, will it come next week? I don't know if that's going to happen. My guess is it will happen the following week after the game mode community transmission. So we'll see what happens with that. Now, also, uh, let's move on to... Actually, that's it. That's, that's what we're going to go over today. So there's all of the details that we went over in the video today. Again, hit that like button if you're excited for the Art Trooper and the Droid Commando. I could not wait. We are counting down the days to March 26th where we're going to get these two new reinforcements with the new game mode. I think it's going to be the biggest month for Battlefront 2 easily. And then don't forget, we're also getting Count Dooku's new pajama skin as well. So don't forget that either. But I'll see you guys next time. Hope you enjoyed the video, enjoy the rest of your day, and may the Force be with you, always.